family says they woke up this weekend and their car was gone. And when the owner, Ryan Higgins, couldn't reach New Orleans police, he decided to track down the stolen vehicle himself. Eleanor Tabone has the story. Watch closely. You see people running down the street. One stops and starts looking through an SUV. Then you see this white truck follow. Ryan Higgins says the suspects then get into his family's 2022 Tahoe and eventually take off. I woke up uh, about 6 a.m. Saturday morning uh, to my wife calling me downstairs because she realized the car was gone. Ryan says during the early hours of May 4th, his SUV was stolen. He says the family did leave the keys in the car. Yeah, kind of in the chaos of getting the kids uh, in the house on a Friday afternoon after school. Ryan says, thankfully, an air tag was inside. I was able to see that the air tag ping last at a street uh, in New Orleans East off the Crowder exit. He says the family called NOPD's third district. At that time, we weren't able to get anybody to answer the phone. With the air tag pinging his SUV's location, he decided to go get it himself. And an hour later, his SUV was back home. NOPD says a debit card was reported missing from the SUV. The department recommends vehicle owners lock and secure their vehicle when not in use. NOPD also said they don't recommend victims in criminal incidents attempt to directly recover stolen property for both safety purposes and to preserve possible evidence for investigatory purposes. Ryan says he's calling for proactive policing to prevent more cars being stolen. I think you could easily catch people in the act if you had officers out there in force. I mean, you know what time they're going to come. Eleanor Tabone, WWL, Louisiana. NOPD says they're still investigating and anyone with information should contact them or Crime Stoppers. As for that call to the police station, NOPD told us, quote, with the exception of the 8th District Station, which is open 24 hours, the remaining seven NOPD district stations have hours of operation from 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. End quote. While officers are on duty patrolling in their districts 24 hours, the station is not open to the public during overnight hours. It